Good afternoon, everybody, and happy Friday. So it is officially the first day of, first full day of summer here in my house. So um, my kindergartner got out of school on Monday. My middle schoolers got out of school yesterday. So today was the first full day that everybody was home. And it was raining outside and I'm already uh, wait, hoping it's September 4th. <laughs> Um, it's going to be a long, long summer. Uh, kids are already bickering and eating everything in sight. <laughs> so I just ran to the grocery store. Um, I thought I'd pop on and show you this um, quick little haul. Um, I am not going to be winning any Mother of the Year awards <laughs> for this uh, grocery haul, but you know what? It's summertime. This lighting's horrible. <laughs> it's summertime and we are just going party like it's 1985. So let me go ahead and show you what I got. All right, so we're gonna start over here. Um, a lot of the things that I got are things that I've been seeing on Instagram lately, just new products and stuff that I'm really excited to try. We got some marshmallows. These are the moon marshmallows. It's to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the moon landing. So I thought these would be um, fun for the kids. Oh, look at that. The package glows in the dark. Woohoo! See back four stickers. Oh, look at that. I didn't even notice that. That is pretty, pretty cool. My little one's gonna love that. So we got some moon marshmallows. Um, I saw this in the store. I have never tried it before. I don't know if this was out last year or not, but it's the S'mores International Delight Coffee Creamer. I'm trying to drink my coffee more at home. Um, so this um, this will be fun to try and again um, Whenever I buy a coffee creamer that I don't particularly care for the flavor of I end up using it in my baking um, And it ends up working out great just so that it doesn't go to waste uh, Gallon of milk we have gone through a whole gallon of milk in about a day and a half So I have a feeling that I'm going to be buying a lot more milk um, These are new these are brownie cookies. They're brownies um, it's new by Pillsbury. Um, oh, bake in liners and tin. Huh, pretty cool. So I figured I would give these a try. I cook my brownies um, when I make them homemade um, in the little muffin tins anyways um, a lot of the time. So curious to see how that tastes. And then we have these ones. They have um, little marshmallow bits inside. So these are two new things. Um, I'll probably have the kids help me uh, make those up. And then I got two packages of sausage. They had them on sale for $2.25. I will probably make up a big uh, goulash or sauce or something like that in the next couple of days and I'll uh, use that up. I grabbed a bag of frozen shrimp I'm gonna use for dinner tonight. Um, I got some chips, deluxe rainbow cookies, and then some soft batch cookies. I love the soft batch cookies. So those will probably go in my little snack drawer and I'll leave these out for the kids. Um, and just to show that I'm not uh, buying complete junk, I got a watermelon. Get the kids, get some of that fruit in their system. Um, I bought some potatoes. Um, I'm making steak and shrimp for dinner tonight and I have a hankering for potatoes. So I grabbed just a five pound bag of potatoes. Um, now I found this coffee Oh, when was it? Uh, I think it was Monday at one of my stop and shops. Now, I haven't seen it at Walmart. I haven't seen it at Target. Not all stop and shops have it, but one particular stop and shop in my area has it, and it is delicious. Um, I made cold brew with it. Um, if you hop over to my Instagram, um, I have um, a picture of my cold brew um, I just mix half cold brew, half hot chocolate, I mean hot chocolate, half chocolate milk, and then I drizzled a little bit of chocolate inside the cup. Oh my goodness, this is absolutely delicious. So I had to grab another one. Um, it says that it has marshmallow and graham notes. I don't taste any of the graham notes. I do taste like a hint of marshmallow in it though, um, but it's really, really good. So I grabbed another package of that. Uh, my little one went with me, and so she saw this Toy Story 4 cereal. Um, what is it? Carnival Berry. Um, she just, she begged me to grab it, so I did. And we got Buzz Lightyear on the other side. So I told her that if we get the new cereals, um, 
she's got to eat it. <laughs> so I'm sure that that'll get gobbled down um, within the next couple days. I don't know if you have tried this new Pepperidge Farm farmhouse bread. It's a little bit more expensive than like the regular, you know, 99 cent loaf of bread that I usually buy. Um, but this is really, really good. Um, they have the sweet Hawaiian. They got all different uh, flavors. They got the whole wheat, the crackling oat and all that other stuff. But um, I buy the sweet Hawaiian and then the, uh, the butter bread. Oh my goodness. These are absolutely delicious. And this does taste um, similar to the King's Hawaiian bread. Um, not exactly like it. But for me to find the loaves of King's Hawaiian bread, usually I have to order them from their website. Um, I can find the hamburger buns, the hot dog buns, the rolls, but the actual loaves of bread are very hard for me to find around here. Um, but I have ordered them off of their website before and they come super, super fresh. Um, but, you know, for me to sit down, order it and wait for it to come in the mail, you know, um, it's very time consuming. So I just, um, started buying this farmhouse sweet Hawaiian bread and it does taste pretty gosh darn good. All right, big mama's sucking up on her Pepsi. Um, I am a Pepsi person, not a Coca-Cola person. Um, so I started drinking the Pepsi caffeine free um, simply because it helps calm my jitters. And also my kids like to sneak sips of my soda when I'm not looking. So I figured, um, if they're gonna be sneaking sips, I'd rather it be caffeine free. Um, and I really can't taste the difference between the regular and the caffeine free. So I started grabbing that. I grabbed the thing of Sierra Mist and then we got a little grape crush going over here for the kids. Um, I think I'm gonna be taking them on some hikes and just hanging out in the backyard and everything. Give them a little treat. And then this was actually new. Let me see if I can turn it around before it hits my toe. Um, Sunny D Watermelon. Ooh, look at that. So this is the 18 pack. This was $4.99. So I grabbed this. My kids will probably have it gone um, within the next couple of hours. <laughs> no, um, but seriously, um, I like to get these. Um, I've never seen the watermelon one before. Um, so I'm curious as to how that tastes. But also, um, we saved the little plastic bottles and I refilled them with like Kool-Aid and stuff a couple of times. Um, usually they forget to bring them back. But when they do, I rinse them out and refill them with Kool-Aid just to reuse them. So this is my quick, super, super healthy, summertime fun grocery haul. Um, all of this together, um, I believe it came up to 43 and some change. So not, um, not too shabby. They did have the sodas on sale, so that helped keep the cost down a little bit. So, uh... I hope you guys enjoy your summer and I will come at you with my next grocery haul. Until next time kiddos, bye. All right folks, so I just thought I would end this video um, real quick and show you what we're having for supper tonight. Uh, so I bought a flank steak the other day and so I grilled that up on my grill pan inside the house um, because it is raining outside so we're doing some grilling on the inside. Um, I made up some fried shrimp that I just got at Stuffy Shop today. Uh, made some creamy mashed taters. We got some cucumbers, green beans, and I cut up that watermelon um, if the kids want to have that with their dinner. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight.